Kayvon was calling you old. You, <laughs> you know, it's funny, he's older than me. So that's my response to that. You know, he won't tell y'all that though. He's cool though. How do you feel like your two, your guys' relationship has evolved in this past year as like anchors and leaders of this D-line? Yeah, it kind of actually goes back to when I was a sophomore and he was a freshman and I was hurt. And like, that's when he first came and that's kind of where our relationship started. And you know, seeing what he did last year, seeing what I did last year, you know, we both kind of came on the scene together as starters. And then our relationship kind of just grew from that. And now it's just, we all just having fun out there leading the board. So, the dog days of camp are kind of almost over uh, before yeah. you strap it on for real. What are you trying to accomplish over these next couple of uh, days telling the guys to kind of stay fresh and, and focused? Yeah. I just feel the little things, you know, because Aiken's been on me about that, just getting the whole group ready about like, the little things. So I think that's like been my focus every day, is just like getting everybody ready. Because at the end of the day, I can't just be like my, 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 by myself. I have to make sure the whole group's ready. So if I do that, then I know we're going to be fine. Kayvon had mentioned that he's pretty pleased with the progress the defensive line has made. Yeah. Can you give a similar assessment? Yeah, I'm, I'm definitely pleased. I'm, a lot of young guys are stepping up and learning the playbook fast. So and that's really good because at the end of the day, you know, we can't play the whole game. I need them to come in and take, and take some reps towards the back end. So, but like with that improvement, we all like everybody's doing well. So I'm happy to see that. What have you seen from the other groups so far in the defense as you guys are together now in the full team periods? Oh, like the, like the back end, the DBs, they're really coming together, playing aggressive. And I, I love seeing like the back end coming up and hitting guys, you know, Jay Sims, you know, Zeke and all those guys, Justin Barron, like all those guys come up and hit. So I love, I love when I see that because I'm like, when you, when you have a back end come up and hit like, hitting like that, there's always a blessing. How does the defensive line depth compare to the years past? Say it again? Uh, the defensive line depth. Oh, yeah. I mean, it's it's definitely nice to have, you know, like, you know, like guys, everybody's here healthy. And, you know, I, hopefully we have that the whole year. You know, I know if we have that, we're going to be dangerous does up it, front. Does it take, like, pressure off of some of the other linebackers like Marlon and Stephon? Oh, yeah, for sure. Because at the end of the day, we're, like, we started, you know, we set the tone. So without us, they don't really make those plays, you know. So it's good to have that depth, getting guys rotating in and out, you know, each and every play for them. So it's always good to have that good mix. Gail, can you talk about the intensity that you bring to practice if you practice to go? I saw you and Enrique going out a, oh, yeah. a little bit. Just the intensity that you bring to practice. You know, I just got to remind my little brothers that I'm the big dog. You know, that's <laughs> all that was. You know, but uh, it's, it's all love. I love, I love Cruz, man. I want to. I want to push him to be better. You know, I see the potential in him, and it's my job to bring it out of him. So if I got to fight, you know, like rough you up a little bit, I'm going to do that, but it's all love. How do you see that line battle? I mean, you're on the opposite side, and these guys are, are fighting for positions oh, yeah. on that side. How, you talking about in terms of offense? On, on the offensive line. Oh, I mean, I think they have their core group ready right now, um, you know, but me, I. I don't really care who starts. I want it. I want that first five up there. You know, whoever, whoever's the toughest, whoever's ready to go and represent us. That's what I want. I'm gonna go with each and every one of them. Club those guys. So, you know, if they if they can block me, then we should, we should be all right. Okay. Are we gonna see the yellow gloves during the season? I don't switching? know. I'm, I'm feeling the, I'm feeling the swag right now, but I don't really know yet. We're gonna see how I feel. You know, I'm superstitious, so if I don't get no sacks in these, they done. Just know that. But yeah, that's pretty good. I think we're good.